Hey y'all, it's Nikki here. Today's episode of Sheep Tips with Sheep Livestock is how to doctor a broken leg. So the lamb that I'm going to be showing you, um, I'm not quite sure how he broke his leg, but we got home from work here this morning and when we went out to do a check on the sheep, this little guy was running around with a break between his hawk and his pastern on his back leg, closer to the pastern. So we've got him caught, we've given him a shot of painkiller, and right now we're in the process of doctoring him. So let's see what we're going to do here. Hi there. So, all we did was you had a poodle noodle that has the hole down the center of it. We cut it in half, basically. And then we took the other half and we just kept trimming away until it fit nicely around the leg there to make a nice fit all the way around. And that's about as good as I think we're going to get it. And then we're going to take some vet wrap here. Um, actually, the one thing that we forgot to do is grab some paper towel because we're going to fit that to the inside of the leg. So, we'll pause this just for a moment. I thought there was going to be a bear patch where the pool wasn't, noodle wasn't going to cover. Oh, okay. So that's what this is actually going to be for. Just a little. We're looking at here. So here's the break right there, as you can see. Sorry, little guy. So I'm just going to take this, wrap it up a little bit just to help prevent any extra rubbing. A little bit more cushioning for him. And then you want to make sure that your cast here, which is the pool noodle, goes from joint to joint and then just seat cradles in there nicely and then that we'll just snug in over top and you want it to be snug enough that it's giving support but not too snug that it's going to be cutting off blood flow and whatnot. We are pretty lucky. This is just one of our um, weather lambs, a market lamb. So although we want this to be a nice clean heel, if it doesn't heal 100% straight, that's not going to be a huge issue for us because, well, ultimately this is a market lamb. So we'll get another few months and probably another 50 pounds um, on him and then he'll be going into the freezer this fall. But as always, we want to ensure that our animals have the best of care, that they're always in uh, good health and pain-free living, um, uh, stress-free life. So we do take very good care of them here. As do all farmers. As do all farmers, indeed. And if you just put the vet wrap up covering the top a little bit, that'll help prevent dirt from getting down inside and causing an agitation and just seals things up a little bit and unfortunately we don't have a foolproof way to stabilize the leg while we're doing this so there is some level of unavoidable discomfort and after we get this done he's going to go into a smaller pen with some friends so he doesn't get too stressed out but he's not going to be running around either. It'll help limit his movements a little bit. Like I said, we have given him some um, Medicam painkiller, so that's helping him a little bit. We'll be giving him some antibiotics to help fight any infection if there was any. We did get very, very lucky with this break. It didn't puncture the skin and it was a clean break. It wasn't um, offset or anything like that. And then just as a little extra precaution, make sure this vet wrap doesn't unravel on us. We're using some medical tape, but duct tape would have actually been our preference. A little extra waterproofing. 
And we will be checking this again in a couple of days just to make sure that it's sitting properly, all of that. Another big thing we have going in our favor is it's a younger lamb. So its bones and everything are still growing, so he should heal up fairly quickly. But that's that. Yep. And we'll just show you um, him getting up so you can see how his movement will be. Alright, hope you enjoyed today's episode of Sheep Tips with Sheik Livestock, and um, I hope that this helped give you a rough idea what to do if you've got an emergency and you need to be able to splint a break on your lamb by yourself. Have a great day.